255 here. What up? What up? So, Loser Ranger is a Japanese superhero manga series written and illustrated by Neji Haraba. And it has been serialized in Kodasha's Weekly Shonen Magazine since February 2021, with its chapters collected into eight Takoban volumes as of December 2022. Also, briefly, just in case you don't know, and I had to make sure that I let you all know that Kodasha's Weekly Shonen Magazine is different from Shueisha's Shonen Jump. Kodasha's Weekly Shonen Magazine, also known as Shonen Magazine, is a shonen manga magazine published by Kodasha. First published on March 17th, 1959. So that's a short little description from Weekly. Now the official creators of this loser go go loser rangers manga described it as the following when the monster army invaded earth 13 years ago the divine dragon rangers rose up to stop them with the war raging on these great heroes are mankind's last hope or are they in truth the invaders were subjugated within a year forced to continue to crank out a monster a week for the rangers to crush in front of their adoring fans but one monster has had enough. Something has to change. He'll rebel against the might of the Dragon Rangers and destroy them all from the inside. I have not read the manga at all, so this is taken from an only anime perspective, so to speak. I say so to speak because the anime is obviously not out yet. The plot appears to be that there is some obvious deception going on where the heroes are really the villains. And usually in stories, that's a major twist or plot point but they are starting out their anime like this so it will be interesting to see how they change the plot from there the idea of slowly killing off an army that tries to evade you is pretty sick in and of itself and i don't mean sick like cool i mean sick like this is really messed up imagine an army invades another country and that country instead of just wiping them out or making them all prisoners decides we're going to kill one prisoner in a brutal way every week that'd be pretty sick the next question would be okay who was orchestrating this who was behind this show and what's the purpose of it that's also plot points that can be explored and that term monster can mean something else or they could be literal monsters it will be interesting to see if these so-called subjugated monsters were forced to come fight in the army in the first place with a scenario like this there's a lot of great opportunity for some really awesome villains so anyway those are my thoughts this is deep mind 255 out one